Hi, I'm Donna Visman with Weems and Source, and we're here at the Franklin Theater for the Omore College of Design Lecture Series. I'm here with Amy Howard. So, Amy, we saw some fabulous things that you painted downstairs. Tell us about what you do. We found out about three years ago that in the United States, we throw away about 22 million pieces of furniture every year. Wow. A lot of those pieces of furniture are American-made pieces. Um, they're mortise and tenon construction, but a lot of times, even though the body of them is well made, maybe the finish is not what people are wanting. So we took the processes of um, our furniture and making furniture for 24 years and put it in a bottle and patented it. And our tagline is rescue, restore, redecorate. So we show people how to rescue those 22 million pieces of furniture and redecorate them with, um, in their home. That's amazing, the three R's. We're gonna remember the new three R's now. So can you tell me the story of a piece that you thought, there's no hope, but yet you did rescue it and it turned out amazing? We do that story every week. And the exciting thing about it is we have people all over the country that are doing that as well. I mean, um, we talk um, and we joke about it because I'm from the South, I'm from Memphis. You can't make a silk purse out of a sow's ear. The piece has to have great lines. It needs great bones. So that way if you can look at it and be able to envision it in your home, we have a lot of different products, whether it be lacquer, um, our one-step paint, you don't have to strip your piece or sand it. Um, or prime it, you can literally paint directly on top of it and rescue it. So it can have um, a new story to tell, if you will. Years ago, we called it dumpster diving. Now we call it curbside shopping. So we're in the process of... We've, we stepped it up a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> and um, in a flea market, or um, a lot of people go to Goodwill, thrift stores, and find those pieces, especially estate sales, too, um, and find them, and they it's like they see the... The, the lines, they see the utilitarian aspect of it and how the scale would work in their home. It just needs to be able to have a new color, a new finish. So that's where it starts. Um, we love Franklin. I mean, we love Nashville. Franklin just has this sweet historical, um, of course, you know, we, we talked about the preservation and being able to keep things, especially like this theater, intact in that is um, part of our history, but is um, such a sweetness about the people that are here and the shopping, and we have a great shop here called Lulu's in Franklin that um, actually gives workshops and sells our paint lines. So. Oh, there you go. So Memphis has come to Franklin right. right here at Lulu's, right, right down the street, just a couple of doors down. Do you ever come up and help with any of the workshops? I've not had the pleasure of working in a workshop, but I have been up, and um, they know that we support them even from Memphis, but um, we do come here quite often. All right, well, thank you so much. You're welcome. We've thank learned you. a lot. I had no idea there's so much furniture sitting around out there. Yes. All right, so now we have a new plan, Go Rescue. What was the other two R's? Rescue, Restore, Redecorate. All right, thanks so much, Amy. Thank you.